Okay, so here's a word problem. It says the table gives the temperature in, in degrees Fahrenheit in five cities at 6 a.m. on the same day. Use the table to answer the questions. So on the left-hand column is our city, and the right-hand column is our temperature. So let's read the first part of the problem. It says, by noon, the temperature in Fairbanks had risen by 14 degrees Fahrenheit. What was the temperature there at noon? So the key thing is to notice that risen by 14 degrees implies addition, right? So we take our original Fairbanks temperature, so it's minus, this is, we're adding 14. So we started at negative 27 degrees and we're adding 14 degrees, right? And so here we have addition, right, of a negative number and a positive number. So remember that's really just the, the, the sign of the larger number is going to win, so we know it's going to be negative because 27 is bigger than 14, right? And we're going to take 27 minus 14, and the number is 13, so it's going to be a negative 13 degrees Fahrenheit. Another way you can look at this is you can say, if I just have this math problem here, negative 27 plus 14, it's like you have negative 27 dollars in the bank, your friend pays you back 14 bucks, you're still in the hole, right? You're still going to be negative, but you're a little bit less negative, so it's negative 13. For part B, it says, how much lower was the 6 a.m. temperature in Toronto than in Chicago? Right, whether they're asking for how much lower or how much higher, you're always going to look for the difference. And you're going to take the larger, the higher number minus the lower number. It's always going to be higher minus lower. Okay, so it says how much lower was the temperature in Toronto than in Chicago? So let's take a look. We've got Toronto is negative 19, Chicago is negative 5. What's the higher temperature? Which one's actually warmer? All right, Chicago is warmer, so that would be Chicago minus Toronto. All right. And if I look at this, Chicago was negative 5 minus Toronto, which is negative 19. Right, so negative 5 minus a negative 19 is going to give me a negative 5 plus 19. Here again we have two numbers with different signs. If you think about it again in terms of money, you have negative $5 in the bank and you're adding 19 to it, so now you're going to be out of the hole, right? You know the, the sign of the larger number is 19, so it's going to be positive. And we take 5 away from 19 and we get 14, so it's going to be positive 14. So there's 14 degrees difference between the two cities.